Is it possible to crush a car by just pulling a string? We're gonna find out right now. This is the thing that claims it holds 6,000 pounds. Quick release, ready? Put your finger on there, Stubbsy. Pull down, yeah, pull down. And then release that and it drops it. No. So this is what we're testing with that. I'm not so the sure. magnet, this, sure. <laughs> I got online and I waited for UPS shipping to give me this magnet for like a week. Thanks UPS guy. Oh, it was FedEx, oops. 4,250 pound pull force. This thing they claim is for fishing, a fishing magnet. It is, do I dare open the box right now here? It says, warning, wear cut resistant gloves. 400 pounds. We ran off to Vegas and picked this up from a guy who wanted too much for it. So I offered him less and he said, hey, let's flip a coin. Let's go, let's do a dollar for every pound. And I lost 400 bucks on that deal. Don't go to Vegas guys, you'll lose your money. Let's see if this magnet will actually attach number one to this 400 pound anvil. Number two, our little doohickey. Let's see if that will lift the 400 pound anvil and then release it. Let's do some testing first. Back to the magnet. Let's open this bad boy up. Why am I actually scared right now? I'm gonna stick this magnet to that anvil and I have to get it in the exact precise position or else it's not coming off. Caution, strong magnet, moment of truth. You ready for this? Nothing, I don't feel anything right now. Nothing. Oh, I feel pull. I feel pull. <laughs> this is not gonna lift this up, is it really? I was an inch and a half away. We're gonna have to go forward, right? Ooh, it's pulling. It is pulling, it's gonna rip my finger off. Oh. <laughs> That's a solid thought, oh. bud. <laughs> oh, it is. Wow. Wilson one, Wilson five. <laughs> we have to be ever so delicate here, Stubbsy. Come on, baby. Obviously, if I can hit a golf ball by dropping it out of a bucket, I can definitely hit a car by pulling a string. Pull your arm in a little bit. Pull your arm in a little bit. <laughs> Watch your limbs, son. There you oh. go. Oh. Oh. No! Let's try it again. <laughs> this hooks on to the anvil. This hooks onto the chain, which is onto the bucket of our backhoe. And this string will be pulled by me to release the anvil. You think it'll work? There's that. Get this on here like that. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> there is no way that little clasp is gonna hold that much weight. Okay, come this way. Down. Oh, oh, right there, right there, right there. There's no way this is gonna hold this up. There's no way, absolutely no way. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Are you kidding me right now? Hold on, are you <laughs> kidding me right now? That little clip is holding 400 pounds? I. Those of you that doubted it, me, are you serious? I'm absolutely blown away right this very second. Are you kidding me? Three, two, one. Oh no! Oh, no! Oh. What? Nice. Yeah. Direct here. Look at the divots in that wood. Oh wow, <laughs> that one's still there. It worked. Well, the magnet worked to pick up the 400 pound anvil that I lost money on in Vegas. The little clasp, buckle, release buckle, whatever it is, worked beautifully. The uh, little chintzy uh, wire that I connected onto it didn't work very well. Remember this one? If you haven't watched that video, go check it out. World's first 
RC, remote control, BMW. This car, I'm not going to say exactly what went down, but this car right here caused a lot of issues within my family. Stubbsy's getting in place right now. Got the orange cord, the rip cord. Who's ready to see this thing go through the roof of this car? Uh, we got a little friend inside. We'll let you decide what her name is. She has makeup. She's got her hair cut down a little bit. She's got a, what looks like a little stud in her forehead. Uh, it says Betsy on there, but I think we should change her name. In the comments below, let us know what you think her name should be. Who's this in the other back seat? She's got some glass in her hair. She's a little wet. I don't know, maybe she should be in there too. Actually, you know what we need more than anything? Let's paint this car at the same time. What do you think about that flame job? Oh yeah, right there. I think right there. Let's go. Okay, anvil on beamer. Three, two, one. Yeah! <laughs> Through the roof. It crushed the bottom of this can. It crushed the top of it, but it didn't pop it. We got, still got paint in there. So I think we should go through the windshield next. Right there. Currently, it's only about nine feet in the air. We're only dropping it by about 10 or 11 feet right now. We're, we're gonna go for 50 feet next. Three, two, one. So don't miss any more of our videos, yo. Yeah! Let's see, let's get that out of here. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Make a trail. Oh, look at that. Oh, that is as, as custom as it gets. Um, this actually might take the magnet off. Can you see that? We're gonna be hooking it. We may not be able to get this out of the car. Watch yourself. It's not coming off. Go that way. <laughs> this might be it. Oh, do it. Go, go. Oh, it's oh. off. <laughs> Anvil, 400 pounds. Spray can, 20 ounces. We're going to smash this spray paint. Three, two, one. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm good, man. <laughs> I have been with the rocker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at the crap. Are you getting cleaned off? Dude, we don't want to have to use lacquer thinner on that thing. I don't think that's going to work. You can't wet it, it'll dry faster. You got acid spit. Dude, you been eating lemons? What about pickles? You been eating pickles? Now for the ultimate goal we need to find the marble in the spray can. Oh, it's right on top. Look at this. There it is. Right on top. Steely, will it stick to a magnet? Yep. We may need to name this one. <laughs> it might be over with. What, what's he doing to the... Oh, now the family's really going to be messed up. Oh, Stubbsy. Oh, Stubbsy. All the, the chain came out. Oh man. Oh Stubbs, he's angry. Better get him some food. Oh, that's a good carabiner in there. Salvage that carabiner right there. There's the stereo. <laughs> oh, I think it popped the gas tank. <laughs> 